Okay, we're back and like I told you, we are now on page 425 and 426, yes, in your map, chapter 19, okay? I'm gonna help you through this to a great extent and then I'm going to cut you loose. So, this is estimating. Now, remember, I didn't have room here really, but if I did have a little bit more space, I'm gonna consolidate that uh, number line. You've got 300, then you've got 400, and then you've got 500, okay? Now remember the magic middle would be 50, right? So that would be 450 and above, you round up. 350 and above, you round up to 400. 450, round to five. 449, rounds down. 349, rounds down to 400. <clears throat> so let's do some together, okay? Uh, we're looking at number two. It's 485, I don't think that's a three. It's so hard to tell on my book because they drew a line through it. No, 485. Okay, so you want to know, does 485 round up or down? Is 485 greater than 450? Is 85 more than 50? Yes, it is. So that would be 500. 318, is 318 greater than 350? Is 18 more than 50? No, so it rounds down. So you do the math. They're just simplifying it for you, rounding it off. But over here you do the actual problem. So there's more on the floor. Let's go next door. Get 10 more. 15 take away eight is seven. Can you see that? And seven take away one is six, and four take away three is one, okay? So you complete the entire problem. Okay, 390 is between three and four hundred. 90 is more than 50, so it rounds up. 211, they didn't give, oh, 211, yes. You don't see the 200s here in this chart. This is just an example. But if I were to extend it, 200 would be here. 250 would be the middle. Is 11 less than 50? Yes, it is. So you write the 200. Then you just subtract this real easy. Then you've got to think about this. Zero, there's more in the floor. Let's go next door. So you've got 10 take away one is nine. Eight take away one is seven. Three take away two is one. So that's the actual answer. And that would round up to 200, wouldn't it? Because 79 is greater than 50. 67 is greater than 50, so that would round up to 200, okay? Okay, go to the next page. I started here with number two. What I'm going to give you guys is we're gonna give you guys the rounded, and then you're going to solve both problems on your own, okay? All right, so 591, it's between five and, if we were to extend that to 600, it's between five and 600. 91 is greater than 50, so it would round up to 600. 415 is between 400 and 500. 15 is less than 50, so it rounds down. So you've got 600, take away 400, then you'll go back, solve, and solve, okay? 532, I just kind of look at that. 32 is less than 50, so it's going to round down to the 500. 409, nine is a lot less than 50, so it's gonna round down to 400. And then you just do the math, okay? All right, number four, 532 is between five and 600. 32 is less than 50. 
so it rounds down. 418 is between 400 and 500. 18 is less than the middle, 50, so it rounds down. And then you do the rest of the math, okay? Okay, this is number five. So we've got 580. 80 is definitely greater than 50, right? So it'll round up to the next 100, which would be 6. 11 is less than 50. It rounds down to the 4. 579, that's greater than 50. So it rounds up to the next 100. 483 is definitely greater than 50, so it rounds up to the next 100, which would be 500. 